Headed to Richmond, Virginia today. Might get tatted, I might not. I want something like a Naruto reference, maybe a Tachi. Been watching Naruto since I was in kindergarten. I remember during class, you know, during the year's time when I was little, and even middle school, high school, I was always reading either Diary of a Wimpy Kid or reading Naruto, One Piece or Bleach. It was one of those three, like the mangas, you know. I don't know, it's just always been part of my childhood. Never outgrew anime. Uh, I still love it. Um, Naruto is just a classic. It was the first anime that I really fell in love with. And I just decided to get like a Naruto piece on my leg. And I think the coolest thing would be, you know, to get, I was thinking Itachi or Sasuke, but I think I'm gonna go with Itachi. We'll see how it goes. Wow, it's very pretty here, wow. I'm taller than you, bro. Because you got the fucking Sakai's on, bro. Pack's vlogging camera, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, bro. Alright, I'm gonna have to think that out, bro. I'm at InkCon right now, and I just talked to one of my favorite tattoo artists. His name is Ink Ray. He has around 100,000 followers on Instagram. I've been following him for some time. I like black and white tattoos, and that's what he specializes in. So I was thinking about getting a tattoo right here. In black and white, I just talked to him. Talked to him. I drove all the way from Northern Virginia down to South uh, Richmond. You know, that's like an hour and 30 minutes away. And then he was like, "You know what, bro? I got you. I'll go even lower." So I'm not gonna say the price out of respect. So right now he's looking for a uh, red ink for the eyes for the shotgun. But if he can't get any, he's gonna do it in black and white. But still fire regardless. So I'm hyped. Show them the thigh. This is before. Yes, sir. So yeah. This, so this is before. Before. And then, and then after we'll, we'll get a clip. But I'm, I'm nervous. This is my first tattoo. I want arm tattoos, but I think I'm gonna do that later down the road. But that's crazy, bro. Like I thought he was gonna be booked. Like I, I'm here with my friend Noah. We came early as fuck. Bro, before I get it from this guy, this is his IG, Ink Ray, LA based. Like for example, like. Bro, that shit. Bro. That shit is hard. That shit is crazy, bro. This motherfucker is dirty, bro. Oh my. Ain't that? Yes, bro. That shit is hard, bro. Ooh. Oh my god. Levi. Oh yeah. That shit is, that shit is crazy. That shit's crazy. Air nigger. Yeah. These times. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. See, I want, a, I want like a box, I want like a box, but without the hard outline, so it's like more free, like more flowy. I feel like when you box it, you like kind of trap it in that shape anyways. Like, yeah. I prefer like box shape, but like without the hard outline. So. a day to take care of it. So I'm gonna clean my tattoo after I wash my hands, keep my fingers clean because it's considered like an open wound. The artist, Ray, he actually, you know, bought these for me at the uh, convention center. He bought this for me and then for the soap and then he bought this for me for like moisturizing it. I'm gonna wet my tattoo just so. Yeah, lather and soap. La 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 la
And like Naruto is like, it's either that Naruto or One Piece is like everybody's first anime they watched, you know, for the majority part, like in my age group. So it's only right that I get a Naruto reference piece. I, I look goofy, I look like I'm fucking the fucking sink, bro. <laughs> yeah, I feel uncomfortable, but whatever. Ooh, damn. When there was like the shading. Oh my gosh. Like, how do I describe it? It's like, it's like somebody has like a sharp, not, not knife knife, but like a dull knife, and they're just pressing as hard as they can up and down your, your, whatever part you're getting tattooed. Like, that's how I describe it. Like, it's, it's bearable. This took like two hours, two hours and 15 minutes, I think. Um, and I was just sitting there just. And he, he kept on asking me, he was very chill, he was like, hey, you wanna take a break, you wanna take a break, you wanna take a break? I told him every time, like, nah, I'm gonna keep it, keep going, keep going, and he was in the zone, he was locked in, and I was just, like, to distract myself, like, if I thought about it, it bothered me, but, like, when I thought about when I was going through my phone, I was just going through Instagram and shit, like, when your mind is somewhere else, like, the pain is very, like, uh, it's not even that bad, bro. I literally winged it, saw the anime ink convention, I was like, yeah, you know, I, I was gonna get an anime reference tattoo maybe later down the road, maybe like if I got second or third tattoo as I got older, but like when I saw the convention and I saw he was going because I follow my IG, I was like, bruh, I need to wing it. And on the story, he was like, I might take it walking, it depends, yada yada. I like opened at 3 p.m. when my friend Noah pulled up, went straight to his booth. He was playing Super Smash Bros. He was just chilling. <laughs> he was just chilling. True, but... Yeah, and then I said, yo, I'm looking for Ray. Ray turned out, like, bro. I know you're busy and stuff, but please, if you don't have anybody right now, like, th this is what I want. I want a Natachi piece. Um, I showed him the picture I, uh, of the panel and everything. Originally, I had, like, speech bubbles, but I said I wanted that out. I just wanted a Tachi. And then I said I don't I don't want a hard box, because in my opinion, when it's a hard box, like that outline outline, it, like, it traps the tattoo. Like, I think on the forearm, that would look nice. But on the thigh, I want it to be free. So if I wanted more pieces, it's not like just a box and then pieces. I just, yes, it is box shaped, but it's more natural to add other pieces to it. Normally, I never want to do any color at all, but it was like, it's only right to do red eyes for somebody from the Uchi kind of like. Certified butter, hustle butter. Set it down, set it down. This is supposed to be like a straw hat up top and around this supposed to be like this white you know like just strips i think it was and then you know little bead right here shine gun with the signature and then the coat nikoski that's crazy man he killed it bro let me know if you guys fuck with it if, if you're not an anime guy then you might not fuck with it but if you are man let me know if you fuck with it um it still has to heal so i wasn't gonna add this part but just in case people were curious um, one month after the tattoo was done one month healed um like the first week or two you know like it was scabbing a lot like the second week especially but this is what it looks like healed now this is one month later and in my opinion i think it healed beautifully it healed nicely 